Hey guys, welcome to another Unreal Engine 4 tutorial. We just finished Five Nights at Freddy's series and you guys wanted Dark Deception tutorials. We are here. Uh, we can go to our library. And I will be personally using the 4.22.3. Anyway, let's go to our library and launch a 4.22.3 project. You can uh, use a different version. But I'm not guaranteeing uh, it will work. I think it should work on any version. Um, but it, it can work on this version. And maybe it can work on 4.21, 22, 19, 18 and th like that. But after that, um, I think the two old versions aren't going to work. For example, in 4.10, I wanted to create a project in 4.10, but there was no level sequencer, there was only matching. If you're asking what are the Stalin and this anime girl doing here, this is a Soviet anime girl from one from Girls Panzer, okay? Anyway, we want to create a new project. We're gonna use the third person because Again, it's the most compatible one. Do not use the first person because uh, it's completely different, and we want we don't want the animations for first person with the shooting. We're not making a shooting game. Yeah, like that. We're gonna name it like that. We're gonna, we want the start content maximum quality desktop create project. Just a quick disclaimer. I want to say that I don't, in any case, I don't want you guys to rip off, okay? I don't want you guys to rip off Dark Deception and sell it as your own. Say it's a fan game and don't say it is your own game. Okay, so uh, now we have the project loaded. So first of all, what we want to do is to create our character as always in every series make the mesh invisible make the mesh invisible so we want to go to here and disable the visible we won't attach the camera we will just do this use one control rotation use control rotation yard now we have a first person camera which is working perfect. Now we want to do this. Um, we want to create a timeline, which will be called camera location. Double click, click on the float track, and make it value. And let's have it in seconds. Art key zero and volume zero. We want to look um, at our camera. How much we want to make it go up? So from here, let's say five. Let's say five. So we want to click here. And it will be fine. Zero. Once we have this, um, we can actually go from here, get a follow camera, set a location, and we want to set a relative location as we said we want to go with 5. 
and it does that. So I'm going to split the sword for this here. Get relative location here. Split it's tracked. I want to go to Y to Y, X to Z, X to X. Sorry. So now we have this. We want to click on the camera and we want to make it loop. And save. And um, if we um, let's play tick. Um, no. Let's go with shift. Um, rest. It will play from start. It will play. And released, it will stop. This is too slow and it's not much, so let's make it 10. And let's make it faster, so... Um, okay, this is getting complicated. We have this. That's perfect. Mm. There's one other problem. And we need to get the follow camera and plus fifty everything. So this will be sixty. This will be 50, this will be 50, and this will be 50. Uh, I'll say, do this, and we have this, that should work. We have this, and it's working perfectly. Um, if you didn't catch something, this is the main uh, of the camera. The 50 of the Z, you can see here, plus 10, minus 10, minus 10, plus 10. Easy as that. And we have a movement. It works. Um, we need to get... Okay. We need to get velocity. Um, let's say... Vector length God, I forgot. Okay, so we need to Yeah, vector length and we need to Float it, it 
S bigger than zero. If it is bigger than ten, then thirty. That's it. Then. That means if he's sprinting and his speed is high, and this should work here. Yeah. Now we have him running only when he's walking. We're gonna delay here and go back here. But we won't make him infinitely. Yeah, this works. This works really well. Oh, yeah, I'm tapped. Uh, you may as well disable jump. So we want to go here and get our grab. Um, gosh, damn. It should be. Yeah, here. No. I found it coming to zero. Yeah. So we want to get a jump max count zero. Now we can jump that one. Let's make the shots. Content. Make the shot. Want to get him? Make shots. We want to make it zero, or let's say um, ten. We want to make a shot. Um, blueprint, architect, shot, discard. We want to make a shiny shot. Did I download it? No, I didn't. I'll make a shot. Let's say a cube. Let's make a shot. That's good. So now we have the shot. Um, this is the famous shot, okay? It is horrible. And now let's make it. Let's make it go just for sake. We can make it rotating. Um yes. So location. Just, uh, what body is that? Ah, uh, yeah, so it's the X. Plus one. Maybe do that. Like this. Answer. We have 
I'm sorry to play this in the house. I'm sorry. Go here, pick an overlap, cast a third person character. Um, let's say just this one. So, not, not, do not put this in here, we just need to make it like this, okay? So now we want to go in the again. Another blueprint. We to take cast to third present With all actors of class. No, not yet. Um, for each loop. Completed. Set shards. This plus one. Next, we want to make UI. Let's name it Shark Filter. You know what? No, let's not make UI, let's make a tablet. Don't want her in the camera boom. This is still working. Now we have and uh, this keep. Use the chamfer so it looks more like a tablet. Okay, now that's perfect. Copy and paste. Let's name this screen. Not going to make the minimap, or you know what? Let's make the minimap. We we'll want to make uh, what a character 2D.
one. And this is the 2D capture, so we want to do this. So we have to min minimap. This will be the one that shrinks. Anyway, um, let's get the texture target. A render. Um, let's save it. Minimap. Save. Um, yeah. And now uh, we want to find it. Right click, create material. And yeah, I think we can now go here, click here, and set it as the minimap material. Now we can play and see us. Which is hyper broken. Oh, God. So, well, anyway, let's make it into a 2D you know, sprite. Let's make a plane. Let's try if this works. Yes. It's more. Okay, now we have a mini map, which is again, we need to. Add it under the tablet. No, we actually have minimap. So it's we can add it under the mesh. Oh god. Yeah, it needs to be under the tablet. Now we have a minimap, it's kind of broken but it kind of works. We can do this. Also, we can go to crawl um, in here and change this to something like so we can see the um, some um, change that like this. Okay. Uh, I think this is okay, we don't need to worry about it. Uh, one thing, we can click on the... We can open the shard and make some kind of... Diana cube. Uh, but let's... Take this. Let's make it all to zero. Let's make it very high. Like this, so you can see it better on on the tablet. Okay, I don't know why to have. Okay, I see. Oh, okay, I see. Gosh, what? Wait. wait. Um, okay, so I guess I need to. Um, okay, guess I need to go here, set rotation to zero, let's try that, set rotation. This is so weird. Oh my god. You know what? Never mind. Let's just go this way. Let's do this. We have a minimap, we have a tablet, we have the head, you know, going up and down. 
Now we need to make UI a sphere. Here, right click, user interface, one. Maybe more. Now let's go here and let's um, make. make something here uh, we want to begin play create widget the player controller and add that to viewport and let's set this to player menu one the UI here, uh, we can make um, some kind of click an image if the player is running. If the player is running, we can get the image. Yes, and um, we're gonna uh, make it invisible for now. So. I'm not going to do that now. You can uh, you can uh, make it. You can make some kind of adjustment here, but I'm going to leave it as it is, like this. Okay, so um, we are going uh, to create the counter in the on the table. Put this down and let's add the text. to ourselves we're making a number we want to make it to the center and the center and then here we make it dark and have to take um Here get text render set text make literal text and get the shards and promote this. Now we have one shard. Once we collect it, it should turn to zero. So okay, I don't know why is it exactly. Uh, okay, I know why because um, yeah, five, four, three, two, one. And once is zero, it turns one. Going to branch. Oh God! Please don't crash. Please do not crash. I do not want you to crash. Okay, good. No. Crash down it. Don't crash. Don't not crash. Okay, let's go. Um, in the chart, we can play a sound here. We're not going to do that. From here, we want to branch. Um, Equal integer. Equal integer. If not this, but this is equal to zero. If it's true, well then set shards to zero of the ob obvious. Three, two, one. Is okay, one. Oh, I see. I see. Mm. 
But now it can't do that. I'm just going to leave it as it is. And F is zero. Um, now let's just... Okay, I don't know how to fix that, but I, I do can figure out somehow. Okay, so I'm going to do this. We can get it. We can make a maze, a basic maze. So let's do that right now. Let's make a wall. Don't use cubes because they are bad. They scale the texture unless you make uh, UVs to the unless you customize the material to go well with these meshes. We want to make like this. And yeah, once we have this, we want a monster. Of course we need a monster. Let's do this. I don't want to make anything especially big. So let's just do this instead. Let's do this quickly. This is bad because now we can see only white, which is really bad. Um, yeah, damn it. Mm. Let's disable, let's just do the rotation. I don't know, let's. Um, I'll just do that another cube. That's perfect. Now, let's just move the camera up a little bit. You know what, let's just... Um, Yeah, that's much better. So now uh, we need to make a cube to our stuff as well. Is there anything? Um, okay, I think that works. The mini map is now uh, working. Let's just rotate it. Awesome. We can just get all these shots to one zero. We can duplicate them just so the game is fun.
we want to make a special one, but we need to do it as do this. We can see. Let's eat all this. And let's make a monster, yay. So because it takes forever to download, we're gonna make a mannequin. We just gonna make blueprints, blueprint plans, character, monster underscore blueprint. This blueprint is going to be so easy. We just want to do this. Move to act. I think uh get AI control self get player character. I'm not really sure if this will work. Should let's make him call. Okay, so the max walk speed will be 600, yeah, that's right. Make him a little slower, so we can have a chance to escape him. Um, this, now we have it, so we want to just move it like this. And um, yeah, so we want to give him a different. Let's make him uh, out of the moon. You know that um, statues. Let's make him go. On. Let's just adjust this monster. He's here. If we will chase us, he will kill us. Hope this works. Now uh, we need to make a math mesh. Math mesh bounce. Bounce. Just scale it to the wall, I right, Cards. Um, we don't want them to be. We have. Um, we don't want. We have to want them to have no collision. So now we, we can walk to them. Now he chases us. And now we have an epic dark deception view. Hope you guys like this tutorial. If so, please smash that like button. Because, yeah, I think that's almost everything I can show you in this uh, game that's basic, how to make a game like this. Uh, the rest you can figure out by yourself. We can make a box collision. If he does that, we can that. That's the problem, we need to move him away. What? Player start.
Oh, I see. Sorry, I'm an idiot. Cast to third person character. And now it should work. Okay, I guess it doesn't work. Excuse me, one. Okay, I, this is better than ever. Alright. Yeah, I think this is actually pretty good. So please guys, don't rip off our deception make a fan game. But don't rip off the game. So thank you guys for watching, if you have any more suggestions um, on the games I should show you how to make, please tell me and uh, I, will, uh, I will make them, I will gladly make them, um, yeah, so that's all guys and bye.